Okay, hello everyone. Hello, hello. All good. We're all good. Everything's good. Okay. Welcome. Good morning. <laughs> I already see lots of people here. That's lovely. Hello everyone. Um, I hope you can hear me okay. Hope the music's not too loud. Uh, I've got the fan going and I really hope you can't hear that. I don't think you can, but just give me a hoy if that gets annoying. Should be okay though. Um, let's just move my table a little bit. There we go. I'm excited for today. If you've been following me for a while, you know how passionate I am about life drawing, figure drawing. Um, I think it's the best tool to progress your skills, to gain momentum, to just like learn new things, try new things. I used to do life drawing once or twice a week for about three years solid back when I studied animation. It was really good for character development, um, like a library of poses in my head. So yeah, and my skills just like went pew, like so quickly and it was an amazing experience. So um, yeah, life drawing, it's amazing. <laughs> I'm seeing some cute comments here. Kaylee's getting her tea ready. Don't forget to put your glasses on if you need them, everyone. Also secretly directed at me because I always forget my glasses. <clears throat> Melissa says she's very excited for figure drawing. It's been a while. Um, uh, Madeline, hi from New York. Hello. Fran says hi from Chile. Um, Mel, it's been so long since I've been able to catch a Scribble Brigade. It's so good to see you again. Uh, Maggie May, I've never made it for one of these before. Yay, welcome! <laughs> French teapot! Um, Maggie May, I'm going to be working on uni homework instead, but I'm excited to tune in. Oh yeah, you can just hang out. I love um, when people just want to come and hang out and, and lurk and, and stuff like that. That's totally cool. Uh, May Taylor, first time for Scribble Brigade, yay! <laughs> uh, expelled Mel, yes, I love figure drawing, took class last semester at uni, it's incredible. Um, Molly, I finished my dedicated life drawing sketchbook last night, so I'm starting off a fresh sketchbook with this session. Yeah, oh, that's awesome. Oh, I love that you've got a dedicated um, life drawing sketchbook, so good. French teapot's got, got my coffee to keep me awake. <laughs> Messi Mari, first time Scribble Brigade person here. Yay! I'm a wonder. Hello, friend. You got your tea and sketchbook ready? Heck yeah. Um, oh, so many comments coming in. I'm not going to be able to keep up, but I love you all. Um, so, for me, life drawing is the best when the poses are quick. Like if I could do a whole session of 30 second poses, I'd be happy, but I'm not that mean, not today. We're gonna do, <laughs> we're gonna do an hour of one minute long poses. Get ready. It's gonna go fast, but remember this, the point of Scribble Brigade, the point of one minute long poses is to loosen up, to have fun, to make, drawings that are terrible and weird and wonky and to be able to be okay with that and let it go you know Ugh, it's so fun it's so fun drawing terrible drawings <laughs> is so fun um seriously we need to loosen up and remember that we're doing this because we love drawing and we love playing and experimenting so um yeah Everyone shake it out. We're gonna get really loose and scribbly today. <laughs> um, so I have gone through Pinterest. I, there's actually a link to the Pinterest board in the description, or at least there should be. Um, and I, <laughs> it was really hard to find a bunch of poses that were non-nude, um, non-provocative like looking, uh, stuff that YouTube wouldn't, pick up as like you know bad content or naughty content or whatever so it's basically a bunch of people in workout gear 
um, and like ballerinas and stuff like that. Yeah. <laughs> Expelled mail. One minute is long. I look. I look the. I love the ten second gestures we used to do in class. Oh, that sounds amazing. Um. So let me show you really quick. I'm using my um, onion skin journal, and I did a little sesh the other day so this is what I like to do you can do it any way you like so I usually like to overlap a lot of my one minute drawings um, and they're all quite wonky and weird and I might start in one direction and it goes in a different direction and you know some stuff is a bit derpy <laughs> like that hand there uh, but yeah that's what we're working with so some people like to overlap some people like to do blind contour drawings, which means you only look at the model on the screen while drawing. Um, you don't look down, so it's best if you do it in one line. So blind one line contours, they are really fun. Um, or if you like, you can grid it out and do tiny little figures in each little grid. So I have collected like 40, 30 or 40 images. And we're just gonna go forward, I reckon. At the end, I, I have a Discord. Um, and at the end, if we want to do a little show and tell of our favorite page or our favorite drawings, um, we can upload to that and have a little show and tell moment, which I think will be nice. Now, let me just quickly have a look at this. Okay, we're all good got my little timer now I'm gonna go to my so I'm using uh, the onion skin journal which is like the pages are transparent which is fun so I've actually gone ahead and uh, swatched some watercolors on a bunch of pages and I'm gonna be using this marker by lousy ink it's like a recycled ink Pen. Okay, the sketchbook ASMR. It's so crunchy and crinkly. I love it. Before we go, I'm gonna stick my little scribble brigade stamp down. Yeah, the fan's gonna do that. It's gonna turn the pages for me. Ta da! So satisfying. And the date is 10th of Jan, 24. <laughs> Still getting used to 24. It's making me hungry. I agree, Kyla. Like, it's like um, wafer biscuits. It reminds me of wafer biscuits. <laughs> um, Kaylee, hi guys. Have to make dinner happen tonight, but I will be watching. Uh, will you do a tour of the onion skin? Yes, I actually am working on a YouTube video for it. I'm going to be releasing my sketchbook tour first and then I will do my video on the onion skin journal, announcing it or, or opening it or trying it out, whatever. I'll figure it out. Um, this is watercolor. That's a watercolor. Crunchy chippies, yes. Okay, I reckon we should just dive right in, shall we? It's already 10 minutes past. I've been blethering for so long. Alrighty. Let's go. So one minute. I'm actually going to make it one minute and five seconds because sometimes there's a bit of de a delay when my timer goes on screen. Uh, yeah. Alrighty. There we go. This is our first model. One minute on the timer. Just let's just go. Let's just go for it. I'm not going to really um, do a do a lesson type thing for you guys here. I just want you to see what comes naturally and play and do some silly stuff. Which I guess is a lesson in itself, isn't it? Twenty five seconds to go. It's 
person's hair is very fun. <laughs> There we go, one minute done. Next. Let's go. Tart. Timer on. I usually focus on the bodies rather than the faces or anything like that. Um, just because that's kind of what life drawing is all about for me is getting getting the chance to draw full bodies. working on sketching out more of my characters and writing a book of it. Princess of Myths, that sounds amazing. 15 seconds. There we go. One minute is a long time. All right. <laughs> Next one. Think about weight as well, like where the weight is uh, causing the most pressure. You know, leg wise, where is she leaning on? Um, you can exaggerate the weight leanings, um, pose positions. Sometimes when I get a little bored or tired, I will push myself and like exaggerate all the poses and push and pull different shapes which is always fun <laughs> here we go um, Maggie Mae, today I started my full semester as a comic student. I love hearing what other people are up to. That's amazing! Alright, I'm going to my next page. Let's go! I tried to find a variety of different uh, body shapes, but generally we're all curvy soft bodies in this uh, in this session I find them most fun to draw Patricia, thanks for subscribing. Sai, hello. Four seconds. I just have to show you. I just have to show you. The derp face. The silly faces. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> Love this face though. <laughs> okay, let's go back. Next one. And let's go. My favorite poses are like twisty poses because I like um, playing with the lines of the spine and stuff.
20 seconds. <laughs> My faces are always the best. Yes, I love it. I love a good silly face. Oh, you were drawing in candlelight for a minute. That's so nice, Kaylee. Oh, this is a bit of a difficult one. Can I zoom in? There we go. Let's give this one a go. <laughs> it's going to be one of those ones that always turns out weird. Um, yeah, if you want to jump on to the Pinterest as well, um, if, you want, if you're interested in like uh, tagging, some of the people, um, some of the models that I used, or just like spending more time on them, uh, you can have a look there. It's difficult, this one. And then my brain's like, what the heck is going on? When there's too much information, my brain can't see any information, <laughs> if that makes sense. It's probably some, like, primal reason for that. Like, we can only process so much. <laughs> Next one. Anyone here uh, a ballerina? Must be so fun being able to jump in the air like this. <laughs> Without breaking your everything. <laughs> I did ballet. I did ballet like two times when I was a child, um, but the instructor scared me. So I didn't continue. I thought she was a witch. <laughs> Essie, hello, hello, hello. We haven't been going for too long. Um, but we're doing um, a full session full of one minute long life drawings. You figure skated for a while. Oh, amazing. Next one. My mum is coming over soon and I was like come in come in and say hello to everyone so hopefully she gets brave enough and comes in and says hello to everyone when she arrives <laughs> eight seconds with pens I didn't anticipate being able to join so I'm having a midnight snack and saw the live I'm late but I'm excited to scribble yay uh, Maggie I did uh, ballet for a year as a kid and moved on to roller derby oh my god that's amazing uh, my studio is a disaster I may have to hang and be in company for a while while I tidy <laughs> uh, line of action is my favorite resource yes 
Uh, we use it a lot in figure drawing courses. It, it definitely helps. What I like to do is um, look at the actual shape she's creating. Usually if I'm sketching with like a pencil or a lighter pen, uh, texture, I'll just create the shape and then draw it within that because otherwise sometimes you go off the page and stuff. But yeah, line of action within the shape as well. So good. Okay. Boom. Next one. Next page. I might. I should have um, prepared more colors. Hi, baby. Did I press the timer? Yes. Why are you crying, baby? Why are you crying? the page here. Oh well. Yay, BB's here. My BB. You want to see BB? Hey, Bibi, come here. Come here, my love. She's got her nervous bandana on. Back, 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 back. You okay? What's happening? These babibs with her little nervous bandana on because we went for a walk this morning. She doesn't like other dogs very much. Mwah. My big old lady. What happened? What happened? <laughs> Why are you floating in the air? <laughs> okay, go to bed now. Don't forget. Alright. <laughs> My child. Yes, the sweetest girl. Um, catching up a uh, cro croquet, croquet, cro 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 cafe is another great resource. I use um, GES Draw Party on Instagram as well. I'm finding one minute so fast, but I've rarely done life drawing. It's so fun. It it is fast. It is fast. I my favorite is 30 seconds. Maybe we can end with a couple of 30 seconds just to get us our hearts beating extra hard. Yes, everyone. There is the baby. The baby is the best. She's a uh, ten and a half years old. Rescue greyhound. <laughs> Bumkey. Oh my god. Cute. First time I make the live and I get to see a puppy too. What a blessing. <laughs> you should rescue a greyhound, Mel. They are the best. <laughs> Looking up. This is fun. I like how you t typed. <laughs> I need a nervous bandana to wear when I go out the house. I know me too. Sometimes when BB wears her nervous bandana, it, I feel like an extension of her. Let's go back, shall we? We shall continue. Next pose. We were blessed by the beeb. Right. Not sure where Pia is, our other one. She's probably sprawled out on the couch looking like a cockroach. Cockroach? 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 Ballet point. I love it. <laughs> okay, next one. This one's a fun one. I find clothes difficult. This is why I only ever draw um, nude bodies, <laughs> because clothes. 
take extra. No, but they're fun. Platforms are amazing. Uh, 16 seconds. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Super noodly. Yes. The ba ballerinas are always super noodly anyway. There we go. What's everyone drinking? I've got some black tea, says Kaylee. I don't have anything. I'm drinking sky juice. <laughs> okay, let's go with this one now. Have you seen pictures of um, ballerinas feet? I mean I'm not surprised they look the way they do when they do stuff like this every day all day you know Not <laughs> this one's looking terrible. Oh well. <laughs> Pretend that one didn't happen. A bit of an adult beverage. <laughs> We've got these three. Um, let's draw one, and then we can draw another one. Let's just draw two of these. Iced coffee, heck yeah. <laughs> Hashtag I'm gay. <laughs> All right, one minute, choose one. And I love this person's hair. What a cute human. Sky juice. <laughs> when I was little I used to call water sky juice and um, like fizzy drink was bubble juice. <laughs> so we still call my whole family we all call it sky juice and bubble juice. Okay let's draw the next one whichever other one you want to draw. Seventeen seconds. Hmm. 
<laughs> okay. Nice job, everyone. <clears throat> Next page. I might have to go back and... How many pages do I have left of coloured? Oh, I've got a few more. Alright. Next. This one. We called it water cloud juice. Cute. That's very cute. I really love um, curled up kind of poses like this where things overlap in interesting ways. You can probably tell because a lot of the characters I draw are like kind of curled up and intertwined. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> speaking of static. <laughs> Should be better by now. Oh, good, great. Next one. Yeah, static poses are definitely harder, I agree. This is why um, I like to use my animation background and like push the proportions of the characters and stuff um, when I start getting bored of the poses. Um, and push the, the way the weight is distributed. Yeah. But I don't do it every time, because sometimes that's hard. <laughs> okay, next one. Let's not get Demonetize. <laughs> this one's difficult because of the foreshortening and we've lost her foot so I'm just going to make it up. <laughs> Yeah, really nice contrast. Okay, you can get a chance to do the face. Next. Let's do it. Also cute hair, love this hairstyle. I love um, making illustrations with this hairstyle. So cute. Space buns. Is that what they're called? Now I know. Thank you. 
already? Okay. <laughs> Next one. <clears throat> Let's do it. way too close to the bottom of the page here so I'm playing with the proportions in a funny way. in our house probably because of Sailor Moon I can never tell uh, what is a Smith thing or the rest of the world thing I know it's funny isn't it <clears throat> okay next one how are we all going I think we need a break after this one let's have a quick break after this one great pose seconds cute all right let's take a little wee breaky let me show you what I've done so far <laughs> these are my first ones the warm-up ones um, went a little big they're fun and then did some of these these ones are fun I quite like this one, which I thought was going to be really hard, but I quite like that one. I love being able to see the ones underneath the layering. So satisfying. This, this ballerina lady under here did not go well for me. So I'm glad I could overlap with a drawing that I quite like. Fun. This face. This is a fun page too. This is the one that I had to like uh, stylize a lot because I squished her at the bottom of the page. I quite like the legs posing in this one. Yeah. This sweet little happy face. <laughs> How are you all going? Let's shake it out. We need to re loose, re scribbleify our hands. <laughs> How are you all feeling about the one minute? You um, finding it too slow or too fast? This is fun. I, it's so fun. Um, I love doing Scribble Brigade, but whenever we do a figure drawing one, it's always my favorite time. <laughs> Some good, some air. Yeah, like always. Yes, let's stretch our hands. You love the one minutes, yes. One minute is perfectly just a little bit too short. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. 
<laughs> it's challenging, but I think it's a great time limit. Yeah, and you get you get better at it. it takes a while. Um, let me head over to the Discord. I see a couple of people sharing some stuff. If you want to share something now, go for it. Um, I can put up a little invite link, which will only last for an hour. Um, because my Discord is really for patrons, but it doesn't really matter. You can come too if you're not a patron. So jump on there, join if you want to share a thing or two. Um, let's have a look at what we've got so far. There's some, some good good ones. Oh yeah, I'm looking forward to this. Okay, I love I love a good show and tell. It's always fun. Now let me just set this up real quick. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Discord, there we are. Hello. Let's make that a bit bigger. So you'll see um, down the side, right down the bottom, the Scribble Brigade here. Um, the Scribble Brigade share place. So you can pop a little thing here and we can have a little look. So this is from Lou. Oh my goodness. This, the energy. Wait, it's upside down. There we go. This is really, really fun. I love it. Ah. Oh. So you pre-painted um, your sketchbook page and you've used, what have you used? Like Posca's, markers. This is really cool. <laughs> and there was this one too. These are beautiful. I love um, how you use different colors and layered them. It's really cool. Yours are sideways too. It's okay. We just have to like crook our necks. <laughs> Nice work! French teapot. Oh, this is fun. I love it. Blue marker. Beautiful. I love, I love, I just love overlap drawings like this. Wow! This pen is nice. Looks like you're having fun drawing with it. Draw the shape they make. That blew my mind. I feel like I've levered up with uh, just that little bit of advice. Oh, that's awesome. I'm glad. Beautiful. I love these French teapot. These are great. Nice, 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 nice. Satisfying. Molly. Oh, wow. Ooh, I love the texture of your graphite pencil. Beautiful. I love this. Yeah, I can really feel the, I don't know, the volume, you know? Oh, this is really good. Heck yeah. I love it. How big is your sketchbook? Is it A5? Is it the same size as mine? Or is it bigger? These are wonderful. I love them. Yes, so good. Um, weird is the best. Oh, these look great. I love their faces. The first one, she's amazing. These are really good. Fun. <laughs> the one in the middle <laughs> looks like a very serious dance party. I love it. <laughs> really good characters. Yes. So fun. Amazing, amazing. I like the mixture of the red pen and the black pen. <laughs> the lady on the far right. She's like, how dare you walk, walk in on me while I'm changing. Amazing. <laughs> Space bun girl. No foot lady. So good. <laughs> yeah, we're all loving these. <laughs> okay. This is the best drawing of the day. <laughs> Usually with Scribble Brigade, we have like a uh, derp, derp drawing of the day, bad drawing of the day, but like in the best with most love possible way, like I love drawings like this with the wholeness of my heart. Yes, it's pure. This is winning for me. <laughs> that last one is so me. I love it so much. This drawing is so relatable. <laughs> Nominated for Derp of the Day with all the love. With every beam of love that I have. 
this drawing. <laughs> That's awesome. Weird is the best. Thank you. <laughs> you need this tattooed. <laughs> Let's all get it tattooed. It's amazing. We're not making fun of you. It's just like the most love ever. I love it. <laughs> the stretching one is how I look when I wake up and stretch in the morning. <laughs> Which is the best is crying. We love this. We love this. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for blessing us with that drawing. <laughs> oh, cherry boy. Look at this. Ooh, I love your mark making. Oh, so much to look at here. This is beautiful. That bottom right brown one is really nice. And the middle one of her sitting down. Well, this is great. So blessed. <laughs> Are you using a like brush pen? <laughs> I love it. Yeah. Nice one. Can't wait to see more. Kristen, hello, our digital art queen. These are so fun. I love it. Love the way you draw. Beautiful, beautiful, like movement and life. <laughs> Tomboy, Tombo, bra, not YouTube clowning me. <laughs> yes, Tombos, love Tombos. These are wonderful. I wish I could zoom in. I like the middle ones, the, the space bun girls and that lady on the left who's like twisting her body. Amazing. On the, um, the pants person who's like kicking their pants up like that. Love them, Kristen. So good. <gasps> Shan? Or Shan? Shan? These are so cute. Look how cute they are. I love the faces, the style. It's so nice. And you've pre-blobbed the paper as well and then you've drawn over the top with marker. I love it. Essie says, uh, Kristen, I love yours. You are clearly someone who is developed and distinct personal style, uh, style that I'm jelly. Melissa, so loose and expressive, Kristen. Yes. These are sweet. These remind me of like the, there is, um, girl what were they called like girl power or something those dolls that groovy chick yeah it reminds me of groovy chick from like the 2000s late 90s so good you're not a person drawer well this is the perfect um like challenge for you even if you're not a person drawer i feel like life drawing is essential in all other things just like your observational skills um yeah uh, Kate, look at these lovely brush pen. I like how you're figuring out like the bones of each pose and the line of action of each pose. Really nice. You look cozy. You in bed? I love that. <laughs> Very fun to burst out of the comfort zone. Yeah, they do look like a girl pen. <laughs> they have a style. Go with it. Excellent. Exactly. I love these. These are lovely. Can't wait to see more of those. Melissa, started with two brush pens in my hand at once and then moved to pencils. Oh, fun. Where are my 3D glasses? This is so fun. Yes, Groovy Chick. I miss Groovy Chick bed sheets. <laughs> I had like a pencil tin with Groovy Chick and stickers, like puff stickers. <laughs> these are really fun, Melissa. I love this. This is great. It's like 3D. Very brave. I love that you try new things all the time. Oh, this is cool. It's like, it looks like someone just dancing across the pages. This is lovely. Good colors too. This is your color palette, I feel like. Oh, lovely. This is really nice. Well done, Melissa. I love looking at your drawings. Oh, so cute. Yeah, it's like, it's almost like a rotoscope or a, like an animated uh, turn of events kind of thing. You should try the double blind again, yeah. Love it. Look at all the love you've gotten. Oh, 
Hello, hello. Good to see you here. Oh, these are lovely. Uh, obviously on the iPad. Beautiful. I love the overlapping and the layering. Are you doing this all in one layer or are you doing different layers and switching them on and off as you go? Love the color. I love the face shape of this uh, red one. Love it. Love your work always. Beautiful. Kayla. Thanks, Kayla. Packer. Oh, fun. This marker is spent. <laughs> I love it when markers are running out of juice. This is really fun. Look at all this energy. That that like leaning back character in the bottom on the left is amazing. And that like wide leg stance above it. This is so much fun, so much energy. I love it. Thanks, Essie. It's so nice chatting with you. We'll see you again, maybe in a minute. <laughs> You're too chicken to do it on one layer, Kayla. <laughs> Caitlin, hi Caitlin. Oh, these are beautiful. Good sense of movement, movement and shape. That first one, I love that first one. Like the curve of the butt and the tummy. It's really nice. Ooh, fun. I love this. These are really nice. Your proportions are amazing. I love I love that one on the far left with the space buns. Just just those two little circles just read so much. I'm trying to keep up with your comments as well. It's like it's all one person dancing. Yeah. I love them. Oh, these are your art supplies. Cute. Every single art supply possible. I love it. <laughs> the cherry boy, another page with the tombos. Beautiful. Beautiful. Your proportions are amazing too. These are great. I love the soft color palettes as well. Thank you. Love to hear that my proportions are good. <laughs> Looking up. Oh, fabulous. These are wonderful. Love this. That brush pen texture is just delicious. I love it. Nice. I'm going to speed up a little bit because I want to keep drawing. Nice job. The paper texture is nice too. Thank you. Oh, heck yeah. Is that a blind contour? I love that. Love that. Amazing. I love this so much. This is awesome. Cool style. <laughs> I'm just going to touch your knee a little bit. Amazing. Pixie with pens. Thank you. Snuddles. Some blind contouring. That was my favorite. Blind contouring is the best. The best. This is wonderful. Good layering. Great page. Really great page. Oh, another one. I love this. Look at their cute faces. That pink one, the kicking leg one, I feel like we all did really well with that one. Yes, do some blinds because they are so fun. <laughs> I love it. 10 out of 10. Oh, she's cute. <laughs> the second one, yes. <laughs> Emily. Oh, these are lovely. Oh, I like the just the outline. It's really nice. Thanks, everyone. We'll do another show and tell at the end. Um, but let's keep going, shall we? Thanks for letting me join the Discord. I will join the no. You don't you don't have to join the Patreon if you don't want to. It's a, it's all good. You're more than welcome to be part of the Discord. Um, welcome, welcome, welcome. All right. Let's keep going, shall we? We've got still quite a few to go. Let's go, one minute. Love it, I love show and tell, it's my favorite. I feel like I could just spend the whole time doing show and tells. Then we wouldn't have anything to show.
22 seconds. Can't wait to see your blind contour drawings. <laughs> Everyone. <laughs> Whoever's attempting. It's worth a go just for just for fun to see what happens. <laughs> Don't know what happened with the face. <laughs> 30, oh, maybe the last few we should do 30 seconds. How many? We've still got a few left to go. Let's just do like a couple more. Do a couple more pages of one minute and then maybe the last page can do 30 seconds. I definitely want to join the Patreon after I graduate. My friends and I are all seniors and I've been trying to find more art groups to join to fill the post-school void. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, we do Scribble Brigade um, two times a month on Patreon and um one time a month live in public <laughs> so yeah if you join there'll be more scribble brigades and more art hangout times okay let's go with this one now love this hairstyle Yes, he says definitely join Maggie it's so lovely and Melissa says the best place in the internet maybe off too oh you guys are the cutest freaking love you guys <laughs> all right next one mm -mm -mm -mm. did we do this one already no we didn't The arms so long. Oh well. <laughs> Hard agree. Ah. Oh. Okay. Moving on. I did not like that one. <laughs> Next. One minute. She's almost got like a Superman pose. Sometimes also um, having shadows helps to ground your characters as well. If you want to just add a little shadow, try it out. Next one. I'll put it up here.
This one has a lot going on. Twenty five seconds. <laughs> Perfect image to come up straight after mentoring shadows. Yes, you're right. Look, I'm going to add shadows now because I had forgotten I had just done that. <laughs> Next one. Oh, we've got another triptych. Um, choose one for this round and then we'll do another one. Unless you want to attempt all three in one minute. Up to you. <laughs> Sorry about the little um, magnifying glass thing in the way of some photos. It's just a Pinterest, a Pinterest quirk. Okay, um, and pick a second one. We'll draw that one too. model is great. I like their I like their way. Crack Sorry. I don't know why it does that. I, I think it's when a message comes through my phone or something. Um, but I turn I turn all notifications off. I don't know. It's just weird. Next one. <laughs> Love that little butt squish bit. <laughs> This person actually has tons of pose references on uh, Deviant Art and Pinterest. I remember following them back in the day, um, or similar ones back in the day when I used to post on Deviant Art. Okay. 
this person too, the same thing. A lot of like pose references. Really amazing um, and generous of them to do this sort of thing. One minute. Thirty seconds. Good job. I feel like I rushed through that one. Time is it? Nearly 10 past 11. We'll go for like another 10 minutes, I reckon. <clears throat> Maybe five more minutes with drawing. Let's, okay, let's do another, let's do another one minute drawing and then we can do a bunch of 30 second drawings and have fun with that. And that'll be, that'll be us done for the day all warmed up or the night wherever you are one minute and then we'll move on to 30 seconds this is hard dancing poses are hard especially when we've got bent knees and everything going on <clears throat> Great pose. All right, let's let's attempt ourselves some thirty second ones. Changing my timer. I'm gonna give us thirty five seconds because I'm so generous. <laughs> thirty seconds. Now this is the perfect chance to really push the blind contour and just letting yourself make ridiculous drawings. Have fun. Have fun. Have fun. No pressure allowed on ourselves. 30 seconds. It'll feel, it'll feel okay because we've just done a bunch of one minutes, so it shouldn't feel too short, hopefully. Because we're all kind of warmed up already. But it's definitely still not easy. <laughs> good. <laughs> that was a good one. Look at this. Great. 10 out of 10. <laughs> Alright, let's do another 30. Pick one of these. And 30 seconds. Love how long this person's torso is. Really fun to draw. I love it. You immediately accidentally gave her a unibrow. Immediate unibrow. 
Another sitting one. Floating one. My hands just become like claws during these 30 second ones. I mean, the hands of the character I'm drawing. Gremlin vibes. <laughs> Is it an accidental unibrow or an intentional Frida Kahlo homage? Homage. All right, let's pick one of these ones. This model, she's great. So many poses available online. How are we all going? <laughs> we don't have time to type in the chat. I don't have time to read the chat. <laughs> 30 seconds is like, go, go, go. these exercise people having a good time doing their exercise <laughs> oh my goodness I don't know what's happening with this one Can't relate, yeah. <laughs> Same. <laughs> Actually, I did have fun roller rollerblading the other day. Went with some friends rollerblading. That was fun, but my body did hurt. I used to be so good at rollerblading, and like my body remembers how to do it, but my fitness levels are just not, just not there. So I feel betrayed. 
by my body for not being as fit as I wanted to be. Um, I think we've got two more to go, two more drawings. I'm going to try and fill in a space or so. Two more poses, I mean. Let's go. Yes, she's got a great face, doesn't she? Great nose. This is a lot to draw in 30 seconds. Super wonky. And our last one, something soft to end on. Let's do it. Last drawing. 30 seconds. This one's a bit harder because there's no like limbs and stuff all over the place. But it's a nice soft um, challenge at the same time. my hands um, I can tell from my current drawings that I should be in bed at this time <laughs> I got a pair of leggings the other day that were categorized as athleisure and I was like emphasize on the leisure <laughs> rollerblading is amazing how dare our bodies get old and rickety yeah you know, to get in the way of our scooting and frolicking <laughs> she does look like she wants to be a leaf girl Okay, I'm going to quickly show you what I did. Where do we get up to? Um, and while I'm doing that, pop your drawings in the Discord and we'll have another little show and tell. Um, it was this page, wasn't it? Yeah. So this one, I end up doing really long arms. I like her. And I quite like this one too. She's fun like this like little hip bump it's my favorite bit she looks strong and here's this one i like this one the sideways pose that was nice this was the 30 second the first 30 second one <laughs> what is happening here in the butt and that was the last one we just did that was a nice one I also like this little fringed scruff. That's a good one. Ah, oh, thank you. <laughs> I like this floating lady. I added an arm behind just to make it a bit more readable. And she's good too. Stretchy. Good uh, hip curves and stuff. This lady is fun too. With the stripy bathers. It's a nice one. This one's good. I like this. <laughs> Her face she looks like a blobfish, but I like the posing. Um, yeah. Oh, look, I had one page left. Yeah. That's my pile of drawings for today. Happy with that. Good chunk of sketchbook done. Look at that. Ooh. I'm already getting, getting into it. Fun. Yeah, I stuck a self-portrait in. Those are my uh, resolutions. Here, yeah, I'm giving you a really quick sketchbook tour. A beach. Some doodles. Life drawing I did earlier. <laughs> self-portrait. Yay. Okay, let's check out what you guys have been doing. Enough of what I've been doing. Oh, where did we... where did we... here. Yeah, we saw Emily's last last time. Okay. 
any derpy scribbly blind contours the favorite oh that's so good i love it her sense of weight and like standing on the spot is really good even even as a blind contour amazing uh, my sketchbook uh luna it's called an onion skin sketchbook but it's not made out of onion skin it's actually made out of wood pulp but um that's just the nickname of it that's the name of the company um but there are plenty there are plenty of uh other wait where's my oh there i am the onion skin journal it's flipped sorry um yeah it's like paper that they used to use for old bibles and stuff like that like yeah old style paper fun um, they definitely look in your world. I think I got um, unwarmed during our break and had to get back into it. It doesn't take long, does it? You just filled 16 pages in your sketchbook? Do you recommend the Onion Journal for loosening up? I think so. I like it because because um, it's so see-through, the pages are so transparent. It means you can't make like more finished work because it kind of gets, not ruined, but you see everything through it. So. It's hard to be too particular about it. Onion skin is a term in animation, yes. All right, let's go back to looking at everyone's work. Love it, Annie, so good. Oh, I am obsessed. Okay, I'm gonna go through these. So good. Blind contours, some of them blind contours. Love it. Oh, that's a cute one. Mmm. It's interesting, like, layering. They can tell stories in unexpected ways. What is going on here? <laughs> oh, she's cute. I love it. Here we go. Our derpy friend has some friends. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> no, these are cute. Love it. Yeah, that, this, this is a really good way to fill up a whole bunch of sketchbook pages in one go, isn't it? These are wonderful. Well done. <laughs> the circle face in the middle. <laughs> I feel like that too. <laughs> um, Kristen, I missed the beginning of the stream, but did anyone mention your beautiful 90s crushed velvet shirt? Thanks. Op shop find. <laughs> love velvet. I love textured things. I like playing with the <laughs> the dirt faces. Everything, amazing. French teapot. So I'm I'm gonna just like go quickly through these because my mum is arriving soon. We're going op shopping today. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, the lady on the far left is perfect. Look at those legs. These are amazing. And the woman in the middle, like with her arms up looking down. Gorgeous. These are gorgeous. Oh, amazing. Wow. Love your drawings, French teapot. Such a good shapes. The 30 second ones are also fabulous. Oh, such good work. Caitlin, I used a different Tombow for each pose this time. Nice. Oh, good color palette. Yeah, seeing I like seeing the shapes and the bones of each pose. It's really fun to look at. Love that my mum goes op shopping with me. We, she and I are obsessed with op shopping. It's like our favorite thing to do together. Amazing, Caitlin. Melissa, you're, you're back on the double brush pen. Thing. It looks so fun. You should try it with two like complementary colors next time. It's really gonna make our brains fuzz. <laughs> These are really cool. Very cool. I got some pens a while ago, a few years ago, when I used to do life drawing more regularly, and it's like a double nibbed pen. So it's got this same effect, but you don't have to awkwardly hold two markers in one. I should try and find them and show you. Disco for real. Double the pen, double the fun. These are really cool. And the 30 second ones. 
so much movement like this setup with the long pages is a really cool way to do life drawing I think and that's how you're holding it wow good on you that's awesome <laughs> Well done for trying something new and interesting. Looking up. Well, these are nice. The brush pen. I love the texture of the brush pen. It's really beautiful. So inky. Oh, I love the lady from behind. Really nice shapes. So good. Yeah, so like, yeah. Voluminous, voluminous, love it. The 30 second ones are strangely easier, aren't they? I don't know why. Everyone go try it, yes. Pixie with pens. Left hand, well done. <laughs> that red one is so beautiful. Ooh, I love these layers. It's like they're dancing or they're ghosts or something if you're trying to find a story in it left 30 seconds these are great hmm <laughs> amazing Caitlin wait did you say something no Caitlin's pretty so gestural so great 30 seconds were easier after the one minutes yes nice non-dominant hand I need to try that next time love these Caitlin so good <laughs> cherry boy beautiful it's really satisfying to look at all in a big pile with different colors nice lovely that orange ballerina that's perfect Ooh, fun oh, love this is the paper of that page like greeny gray that's so much fun what a good spread love it so many textures looking up another page oh this is a uh, turned the right way <laughs> Parker. Oh, I love it. So messy and lively and exciting. I love the looseness you can get using your non dominant hand and the wobbles. Me too. Yes, it's an ugly book from New York. Amazing. Yeah, I, I love it. Love that. Uh, snuddles, snoodles, snuddles, great. Oh, these are pretty. Oh, look at their cute faces. Look at the little one in the bottom right corner. I've never heard of ugly book. I might have to look into that. Good colors. <laughs> oh, they're so sweet. <laughs> nice. I like that you colored in the whole bodies as well. Kristen, nice color palette. These are lovely, lovely, lovely. Oh, pretty. Ooh, I love going through and trying to choose which one I like the best, but I can never choose because I keep loving them all. So nice. So, so nice. I love them. And there's the sketchbook all wide. Amazing. Top left with the wide legs. Yeah, she's great. I like the yellow lady with her hand in the air above the final drawing that we did on the right. She's nice. Um, well done, everyone. Yay! That was so fun. Look how much work we made. Look at all of this. I wonder how many sketchbook pages we filled collectively. Still going. Still going. Still going. Ah, there we go. <laughs> All right. Where's my face? There I am. Thank you so much, everyone. That was a really fun session. Um, 
I, I would love if you left a like and a comment after the live ends just for engagement and stuff and let everyone know how you went um, and your favorite way of doing one minute long life drawings. I'd love to know what you learnt today and what your favorite way of drawing was. Um, yeah, yeah, really fun. We should do, maybe we'll do another figure drawing one next week with the patrons, I think, and keep the ball rolling. So uh, I do these scribble brigades three times a month. The first Wednesday of every month is a patron only one. Second Wednesday of the month is a public one like this. And third Wednesday of the month is another patron exclusive one. So if you want more of this, come along to our sessions on Patreon. You can also re-watch them anytime you want any of the old ones. And uh, yeah, cool. Enjoy, enjoy your new skills and your, you're probably all buzzing. I'm buzzing, I'm definitely buzzing. <laughs> I'm ready to go up shopping, get my hands dirty with my mum. All right, the, the link uh, to all the figures that I collected, is, it's a Pinterest board. Um, it's in the description below if you want to have a closer look. Um, but yeah, there are some really good uh, Instagram, not Instagrams, um, YouTubes out there. I use GES Draw Party. There's another one that I really like, which they're not active anymore, but they've still got all their videos up. It's called like Masters Academy and they have nude models and they have clothed models. Um, I like GES Draw Party because it's actual video of people standing there so they kind of move a little bit, sort of a bit more realistic to what life drawing is. Yeah. Crow Cafe as well, yes. Yeah, there's so many resources out there um, for life drawing. So fun. All right, love you all. Thank you for being here. And I will, I'll see you next week, patrons, and I'll see you next month, Scribble Brigaders and um, Scribble Brigaders who are on the YouTube uh, public one. I adore you. That was so much fun. Okay, thanks for sharing your artwork as well. Love a good show and tell. I will see you soon. Okay, bye.